guys welcome back to my channel so I went by the Kirkland's dumpster and they had this wonderful picture in there but of course you can see that they did slash it so it seems like it's not that slashed that I could like put it back together I'm wondering if that E6000 glue, since it was able to stick everything else back together, um, could I be able to do it with the glue? I don't know, but this is a gorgeous picture. Um, I think it's like a beach setting, which is nice because that's what my, my bedroom is decorated as, um, beach theme because it just gets me in a relaxing mood and after the long day that's what I want to do is just go relax so the price on here is down there it is forty dollars just thirty nine ninety seven so I have to figure out something if you know a better way of doing that before I damage it putting glue on it please let me know okay in the comments so we have that picture okay so then um, I went by Bed Bath and & Beyond and this is, was all I could find was the holders for the candles which is fine I do have some candles that I need to make up and Put into containers and so this will help me stack them up I would love to collect enough of these not of these but of candles to make some really nice birthday and holiday candles for people okay so next we have these two um, there's this bag and we have this right here so I went to my lovely dollar store dumpster and I found this bag and this item was in it. It is a Data Vac Pro and I'm trying to grab all the little pieces out of it. So hopefully I grab the pieces. There was a little tray and these are some large stackable bins. So. I thought that was cool if anything look what I found okay and that's from mainstay so that's not from the dollar store but of course I told you it was a couple of shops next to the Dollar General and I've seen it was just different random things in here so I just went on and grabbed the bag I didn't want to hang out there there's a toaster there is a nail salon in that shopping center, so maybe it, a toaster came from them. That's Revel. Toaster. And here's the hose to this little DataVac Pro. I have to see how much that is and it, if it works. Here's some plates, but they're dirty. I guess they were cleaning out their cabinet maybe ew Snickers I like Snickers but not when it's smushed up and nasty this was some creamer I'm not using that I'm thinking this has to do with the vacuum cleaner maybe trash here cashier tray so yeah, it looks like they were either cleaning it out or um, the Comcast just moved their center. So maybe they were cleaning out stuff from over there. Whoa. It doesn't have a little mouse in there. <laughs> oh. Okay. I'm just seeing some little... <laughs> that was scary okay we have some little roaches on there they're stuck on there but man <sighs> thought I was holding some a mouse <laughs> Look at the thing. 
So, I'm going to be a little careful in this bag because I don't want to see in case the little furry critter came off of there. Let me be careful. Um, this is a stamp. What is this from? Yep, it is from Comcast. It is their stamps. Okay. I am going to remove this. Well, together, let's throw that in the trash and it's going outside. Okay. There's some birthday candles. We'll keep those. So we'll keep the tray, the toaster, the birthday candles, throw the plates away, some other stuff, the creamer. There's somebody's key remote. XR8. I don't know what that is. There's a razor that I need to be careful. I don't need a spoon. Oh goodness. It's another one of those traps in there. I'm just going to leave the rest of this little bag alone because I'm going to take this all out to the dumpster. I don't need anybody's critters living in my house. That's one thing you have to worry about when you dumpster dive. That you don't bring any butt bed bugs in. That you don't bring any little critters or little furry critters into your home. You do have to be very careful of that. So this whole bag going in this trash and it's going outside in the dumpster yeah so I'm just gonna see if this vacuum cleaner works if it does you can see how much it is because I'm probably gonna sell it I don't know what, what else I would do with it it looks like a I don't know what the data vac is for so I'm gonna need to look it up but anyway that was a quick haul guys and if you haven't subscribed to my channel hit the subscribe button and I'll see you on the next dive.